Hey, what's up guys? Welcome to another episode of Pan the Organizer. So today I'm going to be revealing a secret that many professionals use in the car detailing world. So together, we're going to be making a quick detail spray that is so amazing and so glossy, you're going to thank me for it. So without further ado, let's go ahead and start the show. So hey guys, I'm Pan, welcome to the show. I hope you guys are having a great day. I know I sure am because today I'm revealing a secret that many professionals are using in the car detailing business. So when they're done detailing a car and they wanna give it that ultimate pop, that ultimate shine and gloss, they use a quick detail spray, like many of you out there, but not any quick detail spray. A DIY recipe that's very simple to make uses high quality ingredients, and that honestly is better than anything I've used so far. You guys are gonna thank me for it, by the way. So I got a direct tip from Avi. So he's the CEO of CarPro. As you all know, I love CarPro products. They're makers of very high-end and high-quality car detailing products. And so today I'm gonna show you how I make my own detail spray using these items, and it's very, very simple. So you only need three products for this awesome quick detail spray. And by the way, I'll drop the links to all the products that I'm using today in the description under the video for you guys to check them out. And you're gonna see me mix these products because it's very simple. So the first of three products that you need is CarPro Echo or Ec2O. Now, this is their new waterless wash and quick detailer. So it's a concentrated formula. So depending on how you dilute it, it can be used as a waterless wash, which is very, very good and very economical at the same time because it's concentrated. Or depending on the dilution, you can also use this as a quick detailer. But to boost the gloss and effects of this item, we're also going to use a bit of CarPro Reload. Now, this is a silica spray sealant that's normally used to maintain ceramic coatings. So every two to three months on your ceramic coatings, you spray one of these products to maintain the hydrophobic effects, increase gloss, increase the UV protection, and boost your coatings performance. So these two items are going to be mixed inside a spray bottle along with distilled water. So it's very important when you're doing mixes of chemicals and you need water, always use distilled and deionized or demineralized water. So there are no minerals inside there that can intervene with the chemicals. And so if you use distilled water, you're getting the most performance out of your products. So that's it. We have CarPro X2O. CarPro Reload and Distilled Water. So this quick detail spray is very simple to make. So for the dilutions, today we're gonna to be making a 24 ounce solution. So we're gonna be using 20 ounces of water. We're gonna be using two ounces of CarPro Echo and two ounces of CarPro Reload. We're gonna mix all that up in one of our favorite spray bottles. So you can use any spray bottle that you have. So there's the uh, Meguiar's uh, chemical resistant spray bottles that come with uh, a good sprayer here at the end. There's also the uh, Spraymaster chemical resistant sprayers. These are more professional grade, so they're uh, very, very good. Again, guys, I'll link all of these in the description down below. And you can also get a uh, CarPro Echo empty spray bottle. So this is a 17 fluid ounces bottle or roughly uh, 500 milliliters, if I'm not mistaken. So you can use this. It comes also with a great sprayer. So regardless of which uh, spray bottle you're using, you're gonna dilute, you're gonna do your mixes, you're gonna pour that in and you're gonna spray it onto your vehicle. Okay, we're gonna take CarPro Reload and shake it properly like for all chemicals. We're gonna measure two ounces of the product in a measuring cup. We're gonna pour that directly in our sprayer bottle. We're then gonna take CarPro Echo. We're gonna shake that well again and we're gonna measure two ounces in a measuring cup. We're gonna pour that into the spray bottle. And we're next going to take a uh, screw on funnel to make sure we don't have any spillage. We're going to take 20 ounces of distilled water and pour that directly into the spray bottle. We're going to attach the sprayer and shake the bottle well. So this is great for use on ceramic coated cars. So when you're done washing your car, you rinse it off. And while it's still wet, if you want to, you can use this uh, new quick detailer spray that we'll be making as a drying aid, or also you can finish drying your vehicle and use this as a quick detailer to remove any final water spots that might be on the car, any finger smudges, or just boost the gloss. I'm telling you guys, this is amazing. It boosts the gloss. The car basically looks wet 
Uh, it's amazing. I'm going to be using this in my arsenal from now on as one of my favorite detail sprays. Uh, it's just mind boggling. By the way, if you go ahead and do this mix and use it, let me know in the comment section down below if I'm right. I'm pretty sure you're going to love it. So guys, trust me on this one. This is going to be one of the best quick detail sprays you ever used. It's very versatile, so you can also use it as a drying aid. You can use it on your paint, on your headlights, taillights, on glass, on chrome. Also, you can use it on door jams and door sills. Sky's the limit. It's going to give a nice pop and shine to your paint, increase the gloss, and just give it that nice slick touch we all love. So nice finishing touches when you're done detailing your car. So again, I'll leave the links to all the products that I talked about today in the description down below for you guys to check them out. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this quick pro tip. So I urge you to go out there, detail your cars, enjoy doing it. I love transmitting my passion for detailing to my viewers. If you like my videos and you loved this quick tip, show me your support by smashing the thumbs up button. And also, if you want to continue to learn more about car detailing, so products, equipment, tips, tricks, and techniques, make sure you hit the subscribe button that's found under this video. And that way you'll subscribe to my channel and never miss my future videos. So guys, thanks for being there. Thanks for watching. And in the meantime, don't forget, keep it tight, keep it clean, and I'll see you guys on the next one.